So this is going to be the turbo support bracket, and it attaches to a stud that's already on the engine. Pretty sure it goes that way. It seems like it doesn't fit that great. Would you expect anything less? Oh, oh, oh. It's heavy. That's a freaking turbo. Yeah, I think I real I saw that. I knew that was might be an issue. But it looks like it'll be just be really close. I might have to trim that out a little. Yeah. So like one guy online's like, yep, so I decided to uh scrap all the fans and get electric fans and Oh uh, yeah. I'm like, alright dude. <laughs> Could just trim it a little. <laughs> just being dramatic. Yeah. Ended up having to trim out some of the radiator shroud here, fan shroud, because the housings were hitting like right there and right here. So I'm thinking now it'll be be fine. We're gonna test fit for hopefully like a final time. <laughs> oh, you can really see those dents in that light. Oh man. I didn't get the shot of me helping. Whose hand is that? <laughs> what? Does he have a friend? <laughs> the guy filming has a hand? That help. Freaking helping so much. Oh, look at that clearance. Trimmed it up her. Oh, that oh yeah, I wanted to see that. Right here. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's kind of hard now though, because the turbo is so heavy, it's hard to push it up. You did this one, right? Yeah, I dented it up here, 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 here. <laughs> yeah. Like four spots. Because I'm pretty sure it was supposed to be dented and they didn't do it for some reason. They didn't dent that one at all. Here, this is all like, oh well, look at that clearance. There's clearance. There actually is pretty much clearance. Yeah, I think that's, that's right. That's not bad. I think that's right where it needs to be. Wow. It's not bad though. This will be bolted up, dude, no this... time. This is, this would work actually. This makes me want to work on a four cylinder now. <laughs> way more room in the engine bay. Yeah. So you want to put that on right now? The downpipe? Yeah. V band it up. This can go in from this side. Oh. <laughs> ah. So we got the downpipe up through the engine bay. Uh, we had to loosen up the sway bar. Completely. Now what are you doing? I'm trying to V-band it on here, see how where it sits. It's just sitting up against a lot of things. <laughs> That's supposed to be. No, dude, they pre-dented it. They pre-dented it. Probably want to zip tie that back as well. <laughs> There's a turbo in your Mustang. <laughs> see, the, see the damage here? Oh my goodness. Well, the downpipe's not even, or the sway bar's not even on. But oh we're hitting right gosh. there. And we're hitting right here. That's that's not a big deal. But this, well, if you, oh, you got some movement. I mean, we're not hitting pulleys. We're really clear of pulleys. Which is good. Actually, that's not too bad. So the only issue might be right here. Because look how close that is. Yeah, that's... But the clamp, the clamp might be right on that. So we're going with the uh, next pipe. Might as well. Yep. I don't know if they dented this one. Did they dent it enough? That's no. the question. No. You want to grab a V? V-band or? 
I'm not really counting on this fitting good enough to do that. Okay. <laughs> All right. My confidence level. Okay. Oh, perfect. It fits up perfectly. What are you talking about, dude? How the heck is it? Oh my gosh, it's gonna have to go through? <laughs> Dude, what? This is insanely tight. It's like a roller coaster of piping. Like, this is insane. Like, you should have just done like remote mount turbo. What the heck? They should have just put the turbo right here. Put the turbo in the trunk. That would have been easier. Well, yeah, so my issue now is um, you put that. There and it's hitting here, and it's not flush here. Like so it's got to be dented more, I guess. See how it's like? There's that gap. Yeah. And it's because it's hitting on all of this. <laughs> yes. That. Oh my gosh! Slurry. <laughs> this is actually terrible. <laughs> this is the worst kid I've ever seen in my life. But I mean, honestly, with what you have to go through. They did the best they could, <laughs> maybe. <laughs> really? I mean, they did That's not verify weird. it would fit in any form. They did not verify anything would fit, but. Um, They're like, we this put is why we RTV everything. <laughs> we put some pipes in a box. Uh, it may fit, it may not. <laughs> uh, a bunch of flex pipes. <laughs> yeah. Have fun. RTV, go. <laughs> RTV and flex RTV. pipes, have fun. What is happening? <laughs> That's why I said when all of them are up there, it's gonna look so weird. I am helping. Marking the one a C line for where I want to put some heat wrap on it because the pipe is currently touching it. <laughs> I mean, I don't even know what to say anymore. <laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> this is, wow. Well, we know everything fits. Everything fits, so we have to take off that one too. Yeah, heat wrap both of those. Heat wrap both. Step one, put gloves on. <laughs> Step one of two. Careful not to dent the metal though. Yeah, oh yeah, it's not <laughs> dented at all yet. <laughs> this might be a pain to work with, this big roll. Let's see. It's hard to do on really curvy things. Cool. There it is. Not bad for your first one. Yeah. And you can already tell. It doesn't bang as much. Quieter. It's quieter. <laughs> yep. Ooh. Ah. That's thumbs Ooh, down. That's, that's thumbs up. <laughs> Red X. <laughs> Green check mark. Here we go. It didn't turn at all. I should have just turned right for it. That was dead straight. What are you doing? Lay up. Lay up. Hey. Oh. Hey. Oh. Hey. Oh. Home stretch, eh? Not pretty much. See my oil filter relocation bracket? Super custom. The way they show you to mount it is like way over here. And then you have to run all the lines against all these hot pipes. So I made this little bracket here and then put it down and I test fit with the bumper and everything should be good. Intercooler pipes are right here. So the oil should drip past them, not on them. Screw it on, should be pretty easy. It's a lot shorter to where it needs to go. Oh, 
sure that's gonna work well. This one definitely hits everything. What do you think? All bolted up? What do you think of the fitment? Something. Yeah? 